All right, what's up? Today, um, I'm gonna do this a while ago. I'm gonna show you how to use the, uh, how to do zones in uh, yeah, Impulse 49. So, first off, what you wanna do is have your session set up. Like so, you have this shit set up, right? Let me put this down. I don't really need all this right here. Okay, this is gonna be one. Now, trick to this. I've already done this once, but I decided, sorry about that, I decided I'm going to help y'all see what I'm talking about, hold up, gotta see what I'm doing on camera, okay, alright, so, what you're going to want to do is, I hope y'all can see this shit, okay, so the zones, right, turn your zones on, now it's going to start with a C1, you can actually start it off with anything you want. Like, you can hit. See, when I change it, when I hit a different chord, chord it, you can hit anything you want. Turn this shit down. Okay, you can hit anything you want. Start right there. So, my first zone, this is my first zone. I choose to end it on whatever, C or whatever. Use this thing to get it out right here to lift it up to go up. Hit that, it shows you where it's going to end already. So it's going to end at B1, and then I want to hit it again. Oops, shit. Hit it again. It show you what optic you want to mess with it at. So you can, you know, turn your knob, use whatever optic you want to use. I get normally keep mine just normal because that's just me channel you really don't have to worry about channel sometimes it'll do it itself uh, but you can go ahead and switch to any mini channel that you want and then this is a uh, the fuck was this T I T P L T P L T P L template for port template USB like template is for like the template I have it on now FL studio but you don't have to really worry about that and then you'll see the zones. It'll say zone two, start. C1, I mean C2. Go to the next one. Shit, I turned it off. Fuck it. I'm sorry, I'm start all over. Not all over, but okay, C2. Show you where it ends. Object, you know, just keep going, dude. Basically, you can just keep flipping through this shit. Basically, as long as you turn it on, you're kind of good. Because, I mean, it's going to lay it out the way it wants to be laid out. So you make sure you have your shit on. Just turn it on, basically. Then, after you do that, fix my little image here. Try to get it all the way down the line. All right, after you do that, it's kind of simple. Once you just turn it on, it's kind of simple. So now I'm going to delete this. Or I could just like replace it with... FL keys. FL keys. I'm going to put four sifts in here. Just because. I'm going to put a four. Once you have that shit laid in, watch this. Okay. I got my four in there, right? Right click on the four. Just these four. Whatever order that you have it in. It's going to basically go through that way. So, starting with this key. Uh-oh. Damn it, I forgot how I did this shit. Video in my head. Mm, one second, let me see what mistake I made. I have to save it, actually. was I turned it on I left it off and I just started hitting over here basically I left it off and I started going through the, this shit so 
when you do it zones turn it on and then you're able to I got it starting on A1. If I push it back, you can always set it the way you want to start. It's fucking cool. Right, you can change them, replace it with anything you want. Strings. Right. Note one thing. When you don't have these four lit up, look. See, this is why all of them will go in line. But you gotta highlight all four of them for it to work. That's about it. So, let's do one quick recap. I'm gonna do this over. For those of you that might have problems and didn't get it before, I'm even going to turn this off. Okay, he went on. Okay. So basically what I did was turn on your zones. Turn it on. Come over here to your uh, minus and plus and go through the steps. You can either put it where you want it. Hit another button, wherever I wanted to start. Or you can just leave it where the fuck it is. Zones, you can hit the octaves. So if I wanted my octave to be higher, you just turn the knob and go through your octaves. Just turn the knob, it doesn't matter. Channels, you really won't have to mess with that. Ports, unless you want to get into ports and USB and all, or turn them off or whatever you want to do. But I found that it works on template, TPL. And, uh, you know, just however you want to do it. Just keep going through. Start in octave, channel, port. That's all it is. And you have four zones. These are four zones right there. So it's four zone ports. And you just keep going through them. But I just make sure I turn mine on. Zones on. Turn that bitch off. And... turn this shit on. I didn't turn all my fours on. So, once I go back, wow, 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 and then, and that was my little tutorial on how to get my little zones working. That was like really simple because you really don't have to do nothing but turn your zones on. But just turn his own on and then just put four sifts in and highlight all of them with the right click button. And you basically, that's it. So that was my video. That's my time. Hope y'all learned a lot from this one. I know my man will. So, I mean, this is really easy, dude. Just turn on his own, highlight, get four sifts, turn, put them in the drop, and just turn it on and go. Man is out to show y'all something else. In my pants. So yeah, hit me up, man. If y'all got any problems, let me know. One.